all right hello everybody welcome back to my channel how are you doing i hope you're having a good day so far right now it's actually kind of late because i'm starting this video i've just i've been doing like shit all morning basically i was cleaning up the house a little bit you know it's that day when i'm able to do what i need to do around my house running some errands just doing shit again that i'm not able to do throughout the week but today i got the chance so i was like Gotta, gotta take the opportunity. But today, I actually want to go into my local drugstore. And you know that very famous mascara by, I think it's by Maybelline. That's like viral all over TikTok and like people have been blabbing about it. I've been wanting to go into like a drugstore and purchase it and try it out for a video. But it's been so long since I've been like to a store. Especially a drugstore, like it's been a minute. So I want to go in there purchase it and see what else they have like if they have anything new that i might want to like you know check out and grab my hands on as well for like you know future videos but i mainly just want to i want to do that today i want to try that mascara out so let's go to my local drugstore and i'll see you guys i'll see you guys when i get home and i'll show you what i get okay okay So, they didn't have anything in the shoppers. Literally nothing. I'm gonna go to another one and I'm really like crossing my fingers. Why is this so bright? The hell? I'm really crossing my fingers that they have it there. I came to this one because this one's closer to me. And I was like, yeah, they should have it here. They don't. So, let's, let's try another location. Let's try that. Hello, guys welcome as you guys could see from the previous footage that i you know was planning for this whole video but it was like the biggest flop because apparently here in canada toronto there is like no sky high mascara anywhere it's literally sold out everywhere and it's very disappointing because i was very you know i've been seeing it everywhere so i really wanted it to test like i wanted to test it for myself and let you guys know like if it's legit if it's just like a hype you know but that's gonna have to be for another time i guess whenever this shit comes back in stock somewhere because i literally went to two shoppers nowhere and after that i was just like whatever but you know it was good that i went to the drugstore because i saw you know there was a couple new things i got some a couple of like oldie favorites like you know i bought this again i also purchased a new item that i have never tried before so we're gonna be reviewing it today i'm gonna tell you guys you know what i think about it if it's good i feel like this came out a couple like it came out a couple months ago but again i hadn't been to the drugstore in a long time so i have not really tried anything new from there so we shall see how this mascara works you know my day didn't go as planned my plans literally just went to the trash because I live in Canada, okay? The mascara that we're going to be talking about is the Air Volume by L'Oreal Paris. My go-to mascara is the L'Oreal Paris Lash Paradise. Like, that's literally the one mascara that I always repurchase, like, every couple months. I actually purchased one today because they were on sale for, like, half the price. And usually, that mascara is pretty pricey. It's, like, $18, just that mascara. So, that's another thing I noticed in the drugstore right now, like the prices. I swear they just keep getting higher and higher and like that's not cool. So I just had to snatch one up because again, that's literally the one that I use every single day. So I always have backups. I try to have backups. Anyways, blabbing too much. So we're going to try this mascara out. I did get the waterproof formula. If you have been on my channel, you know that my lashes, you can tell uh, I have long lashes, but they're flat, like literally flat. So I need to curl them and I need to put a waterproof formula or my lashes will just like they'll be they'll be dead. They'll be like flat. So we shall see how it works. But basically it says ready to go away the rules of volume. Um okay. So make a volume lightweight mascara that wraps lashes and an intense black formula for a blown out lash look. Now they actually have a picture of before and after. We shall see if that's actually the case. You know, I'm gonna be here testing it. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see. I do like the packaging. I feel like it's very, it's 
kind of cute and different like it doesn't look like all the other ones like it definitely kind of stands out and also this waterproof formula does come in like the blue tube i think the regular color is like the same as this like as the lid so yeah let's look at the wand oh that's not what i was expecting <laughs> um okay so definitely it looks like i think it's gonna give me more volume than length the formula seems to be kind of wet but again it's like a new a new wand so that's yeah normal so i'm gonna go ahead and curl my lashes and then we can begin applying also if you're wondering about this look it's most likely on my channel already very nice girly kind of valentine's look so yeah <laughs> Lashes are nicely curled. I'm actually going to do this eye first. I'm gonna apply one layer of it. I feel like I don't really like the brush because it looks like there's not enough uh, space in between the brush, like the bristles. But let's see. I don't want. I don't want to judge. Here's my lashes with no mascara whatsoever. Wow. Okay, so here are my lashes with one layer. I feel like I really like the way my lashes look, but it was very hard for me to not like fuck it up. I'm gonna do the same thing on the other eye. Oh, great. Isn't that beautiful? That's just great. Okay, so there are both eyes with one layer of the mascara. And now I'm gonna apply another layer because I usually apply a couple layers on my lashes. So I'm just gonna do what I normally do, you know, with my lash paradise. And see how this one builds, you know, if it gets clumpy, anything like that. Surprisingly, it doesn't get clumpy. And I thought it would because of the like the wand, but that looks really nice actually. I really I really dig that. I feel like it definitely is giving me a more uh volume than my Lash Paradise. I feel like my Lash Paradise, I like it because it really lengthens my lashes. But this one's definitely giving me a little more volume and also um you know separating my lashes so you can still see like i have nice separation in between my lashes but there's quite a lot of volume at the root wow i'm i'm very um i'm very impressed actually like, I mean, I think you guys can tell on camera how good my lashes look. Like, wow. That's that's with three layers. I do find that it's a little bit of a trickier kind of wand for me just because I'm used to the one that I use every day. And this one's definitely a little bit more... It's just more tight in between the bristles. But it's not difficult to use just like any other mascara basically it's it's a little bit of getting used to the wand 
Also, the formula is pretty wet, but again, uh, even with my Lash Paradise, I don't love it when I first get it because it's a little bit too wet. I like it getting it a little bit more dry after a couple of uses. So I feel like that's with any mascara. I'm just going to try applying a light layer on the lower lashes to see how that looks. I'm not really usually a lower lash line kind of person, to be honest, but I just want to see how it works on the lower lashes. It's very separating, but it still gives volume. Reading on set on here, what it says, it says 84% said it feels light as air on lashes. And yeah, it's not heavy on the lashes. Uh, you would think because it does give you a lot of like volume, it would be a little bit heavy, but it's not. It's actually really, really light and it's easy to build up. Like it doesn't, you know how some mascaras, if they're too wet or too like, the formula is not nice and buildable. They don't, they won't build. This one is not the case. Like you guys saw, I built it pretty much in like a couple minutes and yeah, I'm really happy. My lashes just look beautiful. It also doesn't get clumpy. It just adds the volume but it doesn't get clumpy, which is awesome. It's a win, it's a win. I'm really happy that I purchased this because I definitely see myself using this. I feel like um, it's going to be added to kind of like my daily routine, depending on the look that I want. But even for just like a light layer of this, it looks really pretty. So good job, L'Oreal, good job. I feel like your mascaras are usually pretty good, so. Like they have like the L'Oreal Telescopic. I used to be a big fan of as well. I just haven't purchased it in like years, but it is a good mascara. It's a plastic wand and it's like thin and smaller. So if you're into that, you're gonna like that. But anyways, that's that on the Air Volume Mega Mascara. I really like it and I also don't even remember how much this was i'll put it somewhere here how much i paid for it because i don't remember i think it might have been on sale as well so i just snatched that sale you know but yeah guys i hope you guys enjoyed let me know if you've used this mascara and if it works for you because you know like everything else sometimes something might work for me but it might not work for you so let me know and also which other products you guys want me to try out for the drugstore and give you guys kind of like my first impressions kind of review you know that kind of thing i'll leave in the description box if it flakes off or if anything weird happens throughout the time that i wear it i'll definitely leave you guys you know kind of like a comment on the description box so stay tuned for that and uh, yeah thank you guys so much for watching as always don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed yet and also click the notification bell so you're notified of my videos and right now i'm working on a schedule of like posting on wednesday and friday so let me know what you guys think of that do you guys like that or do you not dig that let me know let me know okay and yeah thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys next time bye